All right. Uh, I learned a new thing. I mentioned in the last episode that we uh, upgraded to the latest model of Apple TV. It's not necessarily new, but it's new to us. And I just set it up as an Apple TV uh, because it's logged into my iCloud account. It inherited all of the apps and, and layout and all that stuff that I had on my prior Apple TV. So that was great. And then the other night, there we are watching the Bruins game on a, a mild time shift. And the uh, the we were watching in the channels app, but using the Apple TV. And up there in the upper right corner, it says, uh, will Brad Marchand score a hat trick tonight? Which tells me that I'm about to see Brad Marchand score two goals. Because they wouldn't ask if he's going to score a hat trick unless he already has two. Thankfully, that happened uh in the course of about, well, for us, it was about five minutes later that in a 15-second period, Brad Marchand scored two goals. And then the spoils for that particular episode were over. But I wanted to figure out how to solve this problem. And so I went into the settings on my Apple TV, uh, the settings app. You go to apps, TV, and then there's all kinds of things that you can turn off. But the two that I turned off... John were uh, show sports scores, which was on, and I had turned it off on my prior Apple TV, so that setting did not carry over. And then there's another one called uh, Exciting Games, and I'm thinking the Exciting Games one is what uh, got me to that particular point with uh, with this. So, so by having both of those off, um, the following night the TV did not tell us that. Uh, or do we think David Pasternak's going to score a hat trick because he scored two goals early on in the game? And uh, unfortunately, though, it was my phone that told me that the, the next night. And so I had to go in and turn off notifications on my phone for the TV app. But, you know, it's fine. It's fine. 